Hello and welcome to a special gothic edition of Stab in the Dark. <laughs> oh yes, we are staring into the depths of despair at this one. Oh yes, we are going to be looking into the abyss, into the darkness. <laughs> the darkness that darkness the darkness amplifies the chill of the falling snow a shrill scream pierces the cold as we look upon the cobblepot household the parents horrified by their disfigured child's appearance and behavior threw him into his carriage and his carriage into the gotham river the carriage floated down the storm drain and ended up in the Arctic world. It can't see the text! Uh, into the darkness by huge emperor penguins. Oh. That's not a penguin, that's a polar bear. <laughs> What's happening now? 33 years later, Christmas is approaching in Gotham City, but repeated sightings of a strange penguin creature have been nagging the metropolis of late. The mayor is addressing the crowd in Gotham Plaza, completely unaware of a huge red gift box that is slowly moving towards the crowd. <gasps> the box bursts open, and weird members of the Red Triangle Circus gang career through the terrified masses. <gasps> and there's Danny DeVito with his big pokey nose. <laughs> The symbol that rises from the darkness to scare the criminals of Gotham City and everybody else. <gasps> yep, we're playing Batman Returns on the Super Nintendo, everybody. Um, welcome to Stab in the Dark. I'm Stabby, and yes, this week or this episode, we will be taking a look at. Oh! Gotham City has a hero who is aware of all evil doings in Gotham City. I think they mentioned Gotham City a bit too many times then. A hero who bears strength and intelligence under his dark mask. He is Mysterious Batman. He bravely stands up against all evil. The fragile peace that exists in Gotham City is reinforced by his presence. I didn't write this very well, or it's very hard to follow with what's going on. We could just want crap at reading, but anyway. However, there is a new player in town, and ever Oh, come on, that was too quick. She used to be the quiet secretary of Max Shrek. A powerful businessman, not that Shrek, not the, hey, come on, dunk, hey. That wasn't Scottish. Um, frustrated by the vis villainous Shrek, she has transformed into Catwoman. She prowls the streets in search of Batman. But will she help Batman? Ooh. Or join with the Penguin and try to destroy him? Ooh, a little mystery going on. The devious little cow. <gasps> the bat, the cat, the Penguin. There they all are. So yeah, oh, 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 Batman, is that a batarang in your pocket or are you just pleased to see me? Oh, I'm not pleased to see you, you pointy-faced bastard. Yes, so that, yes, oh, Batman's battle is about to begin, Jesus, this goes on for a bit, Batman's battle is about to begin, thank God. Yes, I wanted to show you this game. Um, this episode because it is a superb game and if you could have heard the music over my um, chuntering and my voice um, you will notice that it is absolutely superb I mean let's just get into it so let's have a look at the options first of all my lovely flapping bats no no oh I was too slow no let's go back options there we are <gasps> okay so game level we've got normal Hard, special, mania. I don't know what mania level is. Uh, let's just try normal. Rest. We've got three, five, seven. Um, I don't know why they call it rest. Why is it, why is it called rest? I don't know. It's just called lives. Hmm? Hey ho. Uh, we've got attack, jump, special, uh, item, test tube. What the hell? Test tube. I could be throwing bloody samples at them for God's sake. Um, and block. 
guard. Guard block, for God's sake. Sound test, yeah, all that kind of lovely good stuff. So let's exit that. Let's get straight into this game. Game start. Oh. Oh. So all of these pictures, all of this this stuff that we take for granted now, and we think, oh, it looks quite cheap and cheerful and cheesy. Back in the day, all these digitised sort of pictures of the actors. There's Michael Keaton. Uh, you know, oh, I'm driving. Ha ha ha. Oh no, I'm not. I'm not driving. It's that's a bit of a cock tease, isn't it? Really, it'd be nice if I was driving, but hey ho. Um, yeah. So all of that, the digitised sort of like stuff, that was amazing back in the day. That was just like, wow, this game is so advanced. Okay, so this game is like a side-scrolling beat-em-up. It's not... Punch the kids! Come here, kid! Ah! It's not just a, a side-scrolling... Like a side-scrolling beat-em-up. It is a side-scrolling beat-em-up. Ooh! Let's get these clowns. And look at this. That is just amazing. You can just... You're so hard. You can grab two... Ooh! Bad guys. And bash their heads together. You ever, you've heard the term. You know, you'd like to bash somebody's head together. You know, if kids are playing up or whatever. Well, you can actually do it. Wah! I mean, you look at the graphics. Come here, kid! Ah, ah, what are you doing out of... You shouldn't be out of, on the street at this time of night, you little shit! Okay. The obligatory sort of, like, scenery that you can destroy. Oh, save me, Batman, from this biker arsehole! Come back, you ungrateful shit! Oh. God. Okay. Boom! Headshots. Ooh. So the controls of this look are absolutely great, you know. If you've seen my Vigilante video, you know how much trouble I play in that game. Well, this is just fantastic. So responsive, and you can feel every punch and kick, you know. It's just lovely. Uh, it feels great. You've got a lovely Batarang that you can throw, which doesn't... Ooh. Doesn't do a great deal of damage to the the normal walking guys, but the guys on the bikes. I'm guessing it sort of like you know just distracts them for that second and everything, and it, it knocks them straight off. Ooh! So you've got like a little swoop, so you can jump and you can like swoop on top of them like that, which is fantastic. There we go, off the screen. Uh, you got a little jump, flying kick. Ooh, 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 ah. Oh, I love that bazooka dude blows up his own men. That's great. And the combos are really kind of satisfying as well. I mean, you're not really doing any combos. You're just kind of punching. Um. And then the other thing that you can do is you can pick them up and you can slam them into the wall. Oh, that is awesome. And look at this as well. I mean, you'd think... I mean, look how hard Batman is. He can pick dudes up with one hand and choke slam them. I mean, he's like The Undertaker or Kane or. Or The Big Show, I suppose. He's like. Ugh! I mean, he did get, I suppose, accused of having wrestler's voice in the. Um, in The Dark Knight, didn't he? Because he's all kind of like gruff and everything. Oh. <laughs> Kick. Punched by a clown. How embarrassing. So yeah, you've got your block. Which as you can see I don't use very often because what's the point? You've got a ooh, ooh, come back! Ah! Bad guys. You've got a lovely bat that Ooh! Ooh, is it Lucifer? Ooh, teasing. He's gonna shove his red up poker up her bum. Let's sort him out. Ooh, fire clown. You got fire clown. You got thing clown. And guess what comes later? Oh, you just wait and you will see. So we've got the fire clown and the thing clown. Oh, I like they do their little acrobatic moves, which just you know straight into my fist. So yeah, the graphics are absolutely superb, and you know even today, you know how old this game is, twenty odd years old. It is still absolutely playable, so fantastic, so much fun, it really is a good, superb game. Get rid of this bloody thing playing. Ooh, another bat holding a heart. Ah, oh, oh, what did I say? Look what's come now. It's Fat Clown. Are you allowed to call them fat? I'm not sure. But anyway, Fat Clown. 
probably not allowed to call them fat these days. Oh, punch me right into a health bar. Thank you. <gasps> Slam their fat heads together. Come here, fatty. Come and feel the wrath of Batman. Lose some weight, you fat bastard. Ooh, ooh, ah! Ooh, batarang to the face. Ooh. Oh. But I mean, I'm hoping that you can see and hear, because I mean, the, the sound in this game is absolutely wonderful. It really does. It's one of the best film adaptations of a, you know, of a, of game adaptations of a film, I should say. Um, oh man, you've got, what the hell's this clown? They're all fucking clowns, aren't they? You've got tall clown, thin clown, fat clown, fire clown, fucking arsehole clown. It's just easier to run away from these clown idiots. Oh, I'd say that, just as they set me on fire. Um, and I know I did the video on Batman on the Mega Drive, and, and that is a, a cracking game as well, but this is just... Because beat-em-ups, like these type of beat-em-ups as well, are, are some of my favourites. The type of games back in the day. Oh, oh, and look at this. This is an, another, I suppose, iconic moment from Batman Returns. So you fire Batarang. Boom! Now this is the other thing I didn't show you. Your test tube. It's not a test tube full of jizz. Oh! Or it might be, because the screen goes white. It's a little test tube, which really mashes them up. It's like your smart bomb, I suppose. Oh, I haven't got another one. Oh, he's trying to throw it, but it's not there. Oh, let's just beat him up. There he goes. Stun gun clown? That was. Just noticed. And there she is. There's Selena Kyle. Oh, she's quivering. Oh. Oh. Wow. The Batman. Or is it just Batman? Ooh. Let's go back to your place and you'll find out, baby. The cowering lady saved by Batman was Selena Kyle, lowly secretary to Max Shrek. Don't care! The most powerful businessman in Gotham City. So he's the Donald Trump of Gotham City, I guess. Or the Alan Sugar. Known as the Penguin. He looks a bit like Alan Sugar, actually, the Penguin, I suppose. He allies with Max Shrek to destroy the mayor's reputation, allowing himself to become the new mayor of Gotham City. <laughs> burn, baby, burn! There you go. So. That is Batman Returns on the Super Nintendo. An absolutely wonderful game. If you get a chance, if you've got it up in your loft, go and dig it out because it is wonderful. It still holds up today. It's really, really playable. And it's just good fun. It just really is good fun. So I hope you've enjoyed... Um... Ooh, what's that he's holding? It looks like a, a tampon or something. Or a, one of those lady products. It was an item. Okay. I'm not sure. Because you get tubes. So there might be the, the feminine products. Anyway, um, yes, so hope you've enjoyed the video, and um, I'll see you soon again for some more good stuff, for some more retro loveliness. Um, check, it, check us out on the same coin, the samecoin.co.uk, um, where Ben, Dits, and Matt, when he's on, we talk all sorts of lovely good stuff about video games, a lot of uh, bollocks thrown in there for good measure, which is always good fun. And there you go. Well, thank you very much. We'll see you soon. I'm just gonna let these these bad guys beat me up. Cause why not? I can take it. <laughs> Cause I'm Batman. You can punch me and I'll get straight back up. Okay. Bye bye everybody. See you soon.